morning, beautiful people. <laughs> Hello, inside Saigon, Vietnam. Welcome to the channel. My name is Brian Ngo, and here's another day. Today, we are saying goodbye to Saigon. Temporary, just temporary. They ask you how you are, you just have to say that you're fine when you're not really fine, but you just can't get into it because they would never understand. We'll be back, and we're gonna say goodbye to our unit here at Landmark 81 is the tallest building in Saigon and it's so nice to build it yourself. Just a quick feedback of this apartment is not the best but it's very reasonable for this room. But in here I know there's other room and everything else but this room particularly that's it. it this stuff it was a little bit weird I have to say but we're only here for a few days. Not bad. But now we're gonna say goodbye to this room and we're going on a journey. We're gonna head out to the beach. And I will take you guys to uh, this place called Yo Tao. That is a, a beach area in Vietnam. And we're gonna go out there, we're gonna chill, we're gonna eat, and we're gonna have fun. So hit that like, share, subscribe, and we'll begin our tour. Let's go. <laughs> Before we head out, I have to say, I'm pretty hungry. We're gonna order our kind of like last meal in this place, but you have to use this app. Let me show you. So when you go back to Vietnam, you gotta go get this app right here. It's called Grab. So this app will kind of like work for anything you like in Vietnam. Cars, motorcycle, dining, express, ordering. It's like everything in one. So, and it's pretty fast and it's very reliable. So if you go back to Vietnam, get this app, sign up for it. A few inches later. So here it is. My wife has ordered this place called, this is the most popular, I always say, sandwich place in Saigon right now. It's called Ban Mi. Look at this bread. It's like super crunchy. Like crunchy, I'm talking about crunchiness. Look at all the freshness, meat, everything is in there. And of course, this is the pate. I don't know if you guys know what pate is. Pate is kind of like a liver paste kind of thing, but is the bomb. Everything is like kind of like packed individually, like pickles, uh, veggies, and then put it in there. Mm. Then we ordered this one too as well. This is called Boom Mop. So that's like vermicelli noodle with like a fish cake. Ooh, look at this sandwich, huh? Let's give that to this run. Mm. Yep, this thing is good. Mm. So, you gotta get it when you're here. Not, this is not. Hi, this is legit. Legit. There you go. Pinch this. Yeah. 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 heaven that's nearby the city now we're at a restaurant one of the popular restaurants just right at the ocean and uh, we're gonna check it out and let you guys see but we are here guys at the beach area this is just the beginning of the beach because we're gonna go many more beach and resorts to let you guys see how it is in Vietnam let's go all right look at this my family over here oh. Everybody's eating right at the beach. This place has all the fresh seafood there is. Look at this. Right here. Cooking. So this is the, how they serve up beer. They just give you like case and stick it in that. And then you sit your table and eat it. They are starting out. This is just um, midday. Oh uh, yeah 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 yeah. <laughs> yeah. Ooh, fresh beer and a hot day. Woo. All right, 
right, guys. We're gonna try out this fresh fish at the sea. Mm. Wow, so fatty. Mm. Very fresh. You feel like the, the wave of the sea just boom, hit you in your mouth. All right, guys, seafood salad. All right, guys, you know what snail is? This is snail, this is like seafood snail over here. Look at that. All right, guys, I'm gonna show you guys some snail. Look at this there. All right. You gotta take it out with like a toothpick or so. That's a snail. Mm. Amazing. Chase it down with some of the leaves. Mmm. Snail. They have like on, onion, like like garlic, sweet. Man, this thing is the bomb. Mm. Have you ever had snail before? You gotta try the snail. You never have tried snail? Mm. Mm. Amazing. You got some seafood noodle. Look at this seafood, all chunk of seafood. That is clam. So my wife is serving me some noodle. No. She only give me some veggie. That's all she wanted. <laughs> See my noodle. All right, guys. Fresh clam. Oh man. Yeah, man. I don't know. You know. And they gotta dip it in like a kind of like a salt and pepper. Mm. Man, this is this is the bomb right here. This, this is razor clam. Yeah, I don't. You know, I'm okay. I'm gonna have to do it. You come to to trước là cũng hai tiếng rồi thì cứ hai tiếng đó. Hơn hai tiếng đó lúc đó một giờ mấy. Thôi đi thì đi chứ đâu có thể là đúng giờ. Rồi, bơi. Bị tiếc. Um. Oh. Bên đó. Ông bà lúc nãy ngồi thì cái này ngon mà. Ngon. Chị trương giờ thì vui hơn. Ừ. Tốt rồi. Đồ tươi á. Vui hơn. Anh uống ngồi nước chưa mà nó không ngon. Rồi trước rồi sau. Rồi bán nước không Man, you guys, have you seen like baby squid? Baby fresh squid. Wow. Mm. All right, guys, this is like baby lobster in a way. Look at this, so fresh. Ooh, look at that baby lobster. Man, amazing. So much garlic. Mm. Sweet. Wow. This lobster is the bomb. Oh. Yeah. Wow. Wow. This is amazing. Yeah, lobster, man. Come home, man. Oh. Oh my God. Wow. All right, guys. This is lobster with cheese. It's so hot. It's so hot. Let me go. Mm. Cheese very soft. Nice cheese. Paste. Yeah. Mm. Take that on. Mm. Wow. Mm. Six and a half hours later. All right, so now we're going to show you uh, our hotel. It's actually called Melibu Hotel. Let's go.
Alright guys, we are at our hotel. I have to say one thing, it is so hot. I just like want to jump in the pool right now, but I'm gonna let you guys see how the room over here is. Let's check in. Look at that beautiful hotel. All right, we are here. Thank you to our bell boy. Let's give you guys a quick tour. So this is the first room when you should step right in. King size bed. And then we walk through this way. There's another king size bed. This is a beautiful hotel. Right at the beach. And then uh, we have a little couch over there. And then here is the view. Let's open that up. We're right close by to the beach. All right. Let's walk this way. Show you guys the bathroom. Here is the bathroom of this hotel. Huh? Look at this. You got a little tub right at the window. So that's that. Uh, and then here is uh, the walk-in closet. Oh, that cool. That is amazing. All right, so now we're just going to reset, reload, and then I'm going to try and show you guys how this area of the beach is because we're going to go multiple, multiple resource and beach and hotel. We're going to stay here only for a few days and then we jump into another one. We're like hopping in Vietnam, okay? So stay tuned. Let's go. A few inches later. Good morning, guys. Well, good afternoon. Good uh, wherever you are in the world. Good night or whichever it is. It's morning now here for me in Dalak. And this is the oasis of the sea in Vietnam. Uh, I'm at my hotel buffet right now. We're going to get some breakfast and then we're going to head out to the beach. And uh, we're going to do a beach review for you guys. See how the beach here compared to other beaches as well we're gonna go to a lot of beach resorts so I'm gonna give you guys the insight so here is the hotel called Melibu Hotel at, at Yung Tao. Yung Tao. all right let's go get ourselves some breakfast and some coffee because I needed it look at that my mom and dad already got like a bowl of pho oh breakfast for some uh, 21 look royal salute from uh, Chave. You guys want some? Is it too early? Let me know. No, it's not too early. Let's get a shot. <laughs> All right, so here's the like the noodle station over here. So you got all of your sauces and everything if you want. Oh, this is the omelet station as well, or egg. And now we're walking across. This is another station. Let's check it out. I'm not sure what they got, but ooh. They got some, uh, this is like baby shrimp or so for more likely I would say kanji. Kanji is a white heaven rice like this. And over here we got the American side, I would say, bacon, but this bacon don't look like it's crunchy enough. They got sauces, baby sauces. That's uh, pork, chicken. And they got grilled chicken, and they got this one, it's kind of like a fish cake tofu in a way, fried. And then uh, let's see what's this. And they got some steam egg, like boiled eggs. What's this? Noodles. Here is something with pork, maybe. They got this one is seafood and cheese. Oh, seafood and cheese, look. Big seafood and cheese. And this one is oh, this one is nice. It's like a beef braise or stew. Mm, that looks good. And we got a sticky rice station over here. Ooh, sticky rice. I love sticky rice. It means got nice sticky rice. And then you add all these ramen on top. That is good. Oh, look, Tracy. Tracy! This is more likely like a dessert station. You got dessert. Hmm. 
Oh, this is Asian banana cake. Look at that. I can't wait to get some. So now you got more of a coal station. You got cheese. Uh, you got uh, chorizo. You got ham. You got pork sauces. Pate is the bomb. And over here, you got the whole kind of like bread station. You got donut as well. Look at this donut. It looks so cute. Tiny little donut. But yes. And they got pizza. They have a salad station as well, but I'm not a salad person, so I don't think I'm going to really show that you guys. If you're a salad person, by all means, get it. Oh, now this station is the bomb right here. This is the Vietnamese station. They got this one is like kind of like a rice crepe, Vietnam. Love that. Then you got those. I'm going to get some of this for sure. I'm going to get that. And then let's see what's this. Some kind of thing, some don't look that great. Oh, this is like a fried fish uh, or it's, it's called chow tom, but I don't know why they call fish paste, but it's like shrimp. I would say that shrimp, steamed vegetable, uh, fried rice, and this is the chicken soup. That's that. I'm going to get myself some of that rice crepe and be back. All right, guys, here it is. Let's try out their rice uh, crepe dish because I love this dish in Vietnam. And some place hit it on the spot, some place just. So let's try this out. You got dip it with sauce. Mm. Okay. It will be so much better if it's more fresher. But mm. not so bad. Not so bad. Is this rice cake? You gotta have the sauce has to be on par to make it really good. Then the rice cake. Usually, you um. Get it off from the steamer directly. Mm. Yeah, they're getting it. You want to go better with that? This one. Oh, you said stay here. Not bad. Better than outside? Yeah, that one's always bad. Yeah, they're getting it. Before a hotel wine. All right, my next dishes is the kanji. I love kanji. Look at this. I put everything in there that I could jam pack it in there. I got pork, pork, grind pork, some uh, pork uh, belly as well. Let's give my mixture of bowl heaven a taste. Because I needed something hot. Mm. Yeah. That just hit the spot, you know, it's very warm. Mm. Pork is nice. And give it a little thick with flavor. Mm. Mm. Very good. All right, guys. So here is a special sticky rice, but I'm gonna do one. This side is more like a savory side. This side over here is more of dessert side because you can mix that up. Over here, I got the banana, the taro, and this is the yogurt. Mm. All right, guys. I'm telling you, you think this is a regular yogurt, but usually in Vietnam they make the yogurt a little bit different, slightly than than the Greek yogurt and stuff like that. Because let's give it a shot. You know. oh. It's sweet. It's like a little bit of a I don't know, like how you express like yogurt. You know, like a little sour, but it's nice and sweet. That so good. Six and a half hours later. So now we're gonna try out the sticky rice, all right? I'm gonna do it the savory side first, then I'm gonna go. This is how the sticky rice is. I'm gonna put some of this is like kind of like it's called shredded pork and more pork. This is like Vietnamese ham. Put it on top and make it like that sandwich style. Look at it. Mm. Mm. 
Mmm. Rice. Mmm. And sauce with the pork. Yeah. That's good. Now, I'm going to take a small bit and I'm going to do the dessert style. I'm going to dip it first with they have, they have sugar. It's like sugar and peanuts. And so, I don't know how they made it, but it's really, really good. And put a little coconut, coconut on top, and then cut it in your mouth. Oh. That's childhood memory right there. Mm. Yeah. Excellent. And now let's try this uh, kind of like a gelatin, gelatin kind of like a taro. Mmm, mm. not bad. Mmm, good. With taro, mmm, nice and soft. Here's the banana, banana cake. Banana. Mmm. -hmm. Mm -hmm. No, the banana in Vietnam is different. No. Very sweet and very pungent. I was like a banana to smell to it. Mm. All right. One eternity later. Ooh. All right, guys, I am super full. That's the one thing about buffet that I really don't like that much because is get me overweight. <laughs> One thing is all the worker here, they are so nice. Now, let's go to the beach. Try this uh, kind of like electric car. <laughs> All right, we are at the beach. So this is a very local beach. This is not like like you know your typical kind of like uh, Cancun kind of style shit. This is gonna be like local, local. So this is how, this is really like how local go to the beach over here. So now we're gonna go out here and try to set up, you're gonna rent one of like these umbrella kind of seat and then yeah, just chill. So over here, you can rent one of these uh, umbrella thing, uh, 700 Vietnamese dong. Uh, so that's like equivalent to like, um, Maybe like a hundred bucks, 80 bucks, I think, somewhere around there. But uh, yeah. So now you gotta pay for the the bungalow. So here it is, I don't know, the price. 700. Ooh. I am going to relax a little bit, guys. The beach over here, I say it's, it's clean. It's nice and clean, you can eat here, chill here. But I would say the color of the beach, not the greatest color. There's gonna be more, and I hope I'm gonna show you guys uh, a lot more too as well. But right now, this is uh, it's called the Oasis Yong Tao Beach in Vietnam. So the one thing about the beach, I have to tell you guys, is actually really clean. I am very surprised. I thought it would be a lot more like, because people eat and all that other stuff out here, but they kept it really spot on. Even when you're walking, there's not a lot of like seashells and all that. I hate that. Right, gotta get some rejuvenated coconut, coconut. and uh, sugar cane. Ooh, coconut on the beach is always good. 
And now we got some sugar cane. So much later that the old narrator got tired of waiting and they had to hire a new one. Ooh, we are back. Now we're going to jump in the pool and just clean this beach up. But it was nice. Maybe we'll go back there later on, but I don't know. Let's go back in the hotel. We just got out of all these swimming, pool, beach, and now we're gonna take you to a very special, you have, when you're here, you gotta go eat this bun cock. It's so it's like a pancake and shrimp inside in like a cup kind of thing. So we're gonna go there now. It's a very popular place. And we're gonna check, see it is legit or not. Let's go. All right, we're here. So uh, this is a very, very, uh, I would say very popular place. I hear a bunch of cock, so bad. some chili right here look at this man get some chili and throw it in there bam and over here look at all the veggie they give you huh fresh 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 veggie all right so here it is Bangkok specialties shrimp look at that crispy Ooh, that's how you do it. You gotta take some veggie, put that in there, put a little picker veggies, and then roll it up. All right, guys, I'm gonna show you guys how to do it. All right, pick out your nice big kind of like I'm not. This is not lettuce. This is like some kind of like a lever show. But then you take that. You gotta take my cock right here. Look at this. It's beautiful. Crispy, crunchy. Put that in there. Put some more veggie on top. Get some of that veggie on top. Get some of that pickled veggie too. Drop it in there. Then now you roll it up. Roll it up. Just like that. Dip it in sauce. And just put that in your mouth. Mm. Wow. Mm. So I'm gonna take this and eat it bare bone, you were saying. Drop that in there. Let's taste it. Mmm. You got crunchy? Mmm. 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 Wow. Crunchy. Mm. Oh man, I am stuck. This place is something different, you know? It's like, um, the thing is not like the traditional one that you usually is like a pancake thing, but it's different kind of, I would say, dough that they use for it. It's so crunchy, so good. Yes, and if you is in the area, go give them a shot. They are legit yummy. Now let's go on to the next one. 12 seconds later. All right guys, so now after that meal, we gonna go check out another location for kanji. And this is like internal organ kanji, <laughs> you know? It's very popular. So now we're gonna go there and check it out and see how it is because yeah. I do love kanji, but I'm not sure about internal though. Later. So here we are, the kanji internal organ. Oh yeah, look at that. 
There you go. Look at that kanji bowl. Look at that onion. Yum. This is a very stinky sauce. I don't know if you guys know this. is like a kind of like a shrimp paste. Very stinky if you don't know how to eat it, but it's good. Here is the kanji bowl. Look at that. Mm. And look at all this. This is a plate of itself. All the organs there is. All right, guys, bon appetit. Here is the bowl of kanji. Let's give it a shot. Oh, man. It is nice and fragrant. Oh, wow. But it is hot as hell over here right now. Eating this, I'm gonna sweat. Mm. But it's so good. This thing was excellent. But if you like tutorial and testing and stuff like that, that is good. But if you don't, I don't think it's spots for you. But it's very flavorful, I have to say. But man, after you eat it, yes, over here, the heat and say <laughs> the area, there's no AC. I'm sweating balls right now. So I gotta jump, I'm done. I'm gonna jump in the pool. And I'm gonna check you guys in a bit and we're gonna go find a different spot. Let's go. This is another specialty spot is uh, mainly for that. It's kind of like salted egg in a bun. Okay, so we got the bag. Here it is. Let's take a look inside. Mmm, yum, yum, yum. All right, so here it is. So that's how it looks like the salted egg and kind of like shredded uh, pork on top salted yummy all right one bite let's see how it is mm. I think it's on the kind of like a little bit more dry side I like it a little more bouncy but is it legit? I would say, eh, okay. Mm, that's something like super crazy. It's all right. All right, so now we're at another location. My cousin just uh, got, and we're gonna go check out his, uh, his resident here. And we're gonna go for the pool again. Let's go, let's check it out. There's a new condo development here. Look at this building. Beautiful. 